everybody this here's mike all right you've seen the last video if you watched it i did encourage you to watch the next couple of videos that are coming up i have a lot of knives that we're just going to get to the chase um some of them just didn't come out to what i wanted them to they're perfectly good cutting blades there's nothing wrong with them the finish wasn't what i thought they should have been um i put them on the website lowered the prices down some but we're at a price range that's going to be hitting now i'm still working every bit of it out what i'm going to do is is these knives here are no longer going to be on one of my productions um that go on there and what i mean by production means that i just won't be randomly putting these things up they'll be once a year um if they're even that some of them i may never ever get back to again at all the other reason for it is is hawk and wolf knives will soon be switched completely over to mike Ware custom knives um and what that is is means it, it's more custom work um where the the range is moving upwards because i've got a lot of customers that are seeking those and they're asking me about making them and i have a, a lot of years in retail and this past year and a half i've been pretty cloudy so i finally started getting some ducks in a row and i started going out and asking about some of them and one of the larger companies that i live very close to was very interested i took a couple up and showed them and they said if you can do this kind of work every knife i would be interested in buying large quantities from you at your small shop to sell so yes we're going over he did say that he didn't want them to have the hawk and wolf knife logo he wanted them to be custom side because he deals a lot with custom knives as well and he said i'd prefer it to be just your custom knife work um and so i'm working currently on a few that will be sent to him um actually i'm not going to send them i'm going to drive them because we're going to get first-hand experience um i want to know what i did wrong or what i did great and i want to see it so i can read it so that's where we're doing why i'm selling a lot of these other knives that some of them never been on the website is i want to clean the inventory out i want it all out of the shop um one reason for it is when you get down and you're just looking for something to make and you're just making knives just to be making knives you'll whip out a pattern and you'll start making something that's really either not in season or really wasn't that great of a seller at the time but you were just trying to put out work and that's where i fell into that category um just trying to put out a few dollars the extra income that i get off of these will help me increase my volume output by reinvesting those dollars into a different type of grinder that i'm going to be needing and i've already purchased the grinder i just have a few accessories that i do wish to add to it that will speed the process up and be able to put that out so i'm reaching out to you guys giving you the opportunity since you started with me in this whole journey in the beginning and you've given me that i'm giving back um kind of a a, a double-edged sword i guess so to speak or a double-edged knife is um the hawking wolf side of it will always still be hawking wolf outfitters because it won't affect that but when i can still do hawking wolf knives this it's not a contractor and he's just saying the knives that i send him he just wants them to have the mike Ware logo only on it um or the mike Ware signature only on it and that's why he's going to brand it and push it for me to help me with it um there'll always be you know still some bushcraft style knives a lot of the knives that he's interested in will not be bushcraft related tile or style knives they will be mostly hunting style knives or some kind of extreme collector style stuff that he said that he would like to be into or actually they so it's actually more than one partner in that business but anyway guys there's your first part you're going to start seeing some more videos that's going to come out here in a minute it's going to be a quick simple easy to do you're going to go to the website find it buy it i ship i'm only going to ship twice a week though i will ship on wednesday and saturday 
That's the only two days that I will ship until they're all gone. Uh, the reason for that is getting up and packaging stuff up every morning and driving 20 minutes to the post office, 20 minutes back to the post office, and then all of a sudden you get home and somebody bought another one at three o'clock and while well, I got time and they say, you know, I'm not making knives. So Wednesdays and Saturdays, doesn't matter what day that you make your purchase, um, those will be the days that I will ship and they will be shipped basically in the United States um, for the flat rate shipping. I think it's 845 outside of that. Um, it's different um, because, you know, it can take a little extra to get it out there. Um, again, there's nothing wrong with these knives. They just weren't my best day and they're perfectly great cutting knives. They're perfect for outdoor bushcraft, especially if you have a need and you're on a budget. I promise you the price that you see on these here, it ain't even worth my time going to the post office, but I want them out of here. I want them out. Um, it takes away something else that you're going to hear some videos coming up. Um, over the next few weeks, maybe that will understand why we're doing this now and it'll help with it. So guys, thanks. Be watching for the videos. I'm going to make them Mike Ware signature sale and our Hawk and Wolf signature sale is what will come across the title. And you're going to want to watch them because I promise you, you'll never ever, you have given more money for Pakistan or Chinese knives, nothing against those then you're probably going to be able to get your first custom or multiple customs that you've heard multiple knives that are made right here by me. So stick around guys. Keep up. Don't forget it.